Now we are going to start coding our neural network. First we we run Visual, Visual Studio or the ID that you you want to use. We create the, the project uh, how what is the name neural network into I'm going to create all all the files in an H in a point H file to to make easier to to read okay so let's add a new item the name is going to be mirror the first thing we are gonna see from ones class new we are not going to use that and then we are going to init init the, the neuron like this We need the the library stbelief. We're going to initialize the weight as a random number, okay? Between zero and one. doesn't matter now and then we we are going to use protect uh, some protected variables we need for that the library vector and we are going to uh, to put the list of weights in also the list list of weights out mm, we can also write another variables like this output output value and oh, error. the error that then we are going to back propagate to to decrease this this error and the sensibility and that's all we need Ah, if you if you have the same error like me, the the solution is to to write the, the these things important. Return the rand rand max. Okay. So we finished the, the first the first class. Now we can initially in, uh, when now we can create the layer class. New item and another header file called layer. Okay. We also are not going to use the constructor. We 
we are going to make a function to print the, the layer the it will be constant of course and then we are going to overload overload this this function because we are going to create the input layer the output layer and the hidden layer that we will heritage from from this this class now we need to create some some variables I'm going to to make them protected again but I, I don't know yes uh, I will make it protected We need the vector from We need to include the neuron dot h because now we are going to make a an array of of neurons to make the the layer. list of neurons I will call this this variable and then we are going to make a variable to to see the number of of neurons inside we can we can use the 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 function of vector dot size but I don't like that if we are going to execute the code many times So now we finish. Yes, we have finished the layer func the layer class. We can start now the input layer, the hidden layer, and the output layer. But I will keep that. I will continue that in the next video. So see you. Uh, before before going to the next video, uh, I'm going to I have to say you that I will create a GitHub repository uh, and I will make commits every every single video that I upload it upload to the YouTube videos uh, video yes you can you can download it uh, in you can see it in the description of the video. Uh, you can yes, and the name is going to be Neural Network Tutorial. I'm going to upload it now. You can you can uh, do the same as me, okay? You have to publish Git repo. Put the URL in the in the gap, and then publish. Now we have to commit a video one. No, video two. Intro, the introduction. Yes, two introduction. Um, push. Okay, uh, you now you you can create your own repositories and make the changes you want. Thank you and see you in the next video.